It looks like the end is near for Internet Explorer. I'm Bridget Carey, and this is your CNET Update. It's not easy being Internet Explorer. Microsoft's web browser has a reputation for being slow to use and difficult for web designers, and it earned the distinction for being the most despised browser. It couldn't shake the shame even after making improvements in performance and design. But now Microsoft is starting fresh for Windows 10 and leaving IE behind for a new browser program. It's called Microsoft Edge. Previously codenamed Project Spartan, Microsoft officially revealed it's going to be called Edge, and it'll have new features, including add-on extensions, something familiar to users of Firefox and Chrome. It also lets you mark notes on web pages with a drawing tool, and you can share them as an image with others. The browser integrates with Cortana's voice commands, but will a new name and a new icon be enough to get people to switch to Edge? I mean, the icon is pretty slick. It's got this swooshy spike. Reminds me of something, but... I can't quite put my finger on it. At the Microsoft Developers Conference, the company also showed off more of its upcoming augmented reality headset, HoloLens. Although we still don't know the price or when exactly you can order one, we got to see more examples of the holographic interface it projects in front of your eyes, blending virtual images with the real world. In this living room example, different program shortcuts are placed around your environment, and you can keep a window attached to your wall for something like Skype or a video player. If you want to take the program to another room, you just use a hand gesture and a voice command to detach it and have it follow you around. We also saw examples of how this could be used as an educational tool. In this demonstration, a hologram can show the human body in three dimensions to teach anatomy, separating individual systems or parts of the body. Microsoft has said HoloLens will be available sometime when Windows 10 is out, but it remains to be seen how limited the release will be. Microsoft has said Windows 10 will be coming out sometime in the summer. And it's time to bid farewell to the controversial app Secret. The anonymous messaging app is shutting down and deleting all data, and that's according to the CEO. Secret has been out for just over a year, and it raised about $35 million in funding. It's giving some of that money back to investors. Secret allowed people to post confessions and conversations about taboo topics, but the app has been criticized for serving as a platform for gossip, trolling, and bullying, much like other anonymous apps like Yik Yak and Whisper. But not all gossip apps are giving up. Whisper announced it hit 10 million users. That's your tech news update. You can head over to CNET.com for more. From our studios in New York, I'm Bridget Carey.